you're wondering why I'm a bit late uploading, it's because I'm currently halfway through a 21 date tour with my band, The Lost Trades. This is one of my favorite parts of being a musician. I get to see places I wouldn't normally see, meet people I would never have met, and I get to spend time with some of my favorite people in the whole world. I honestly believe that if it weren't for these guys, I would have quit music as a profession a long time ago. And it amazes me looking back, just how terrified I was of the idea of collaboration. I think it's fair to say that when we started this band, I was not looking forward to sharing my writing process with the guys. Despite the fact that we've been friends for many years and I have so much respect for them both as performing songwriters in their own right. I guess I was worried that my voice as a writer would be drowned out, that my message would be somehow diluted and lost. But as it turned out, my voice became stronger the moment I first joined it with theirs. And suddenly, I'd become a part of something bigger than just me. This can appear. also concerned that our friendship might be compromised, but I needn't have worried. If anything, our friendship has become stronger. We've learned that by trusting each other with our songs, with our deeply personal creations, our respect for each other has deepened and it enriches the very fabric of what we create together. Since we started collaborating as a band, we've not only gained confidence in ourselves as writers and as musicians, but we've reached new heights that we almost certainly couldn't have achieved on our own. I now see collaboration as the cross-pollination of ideas in a wild, fertile garden, where ideas evolve and bloom in delightfully unexpected and unique ways. It's not something to fear. It's not a dilution of your voice or your talent. It's an opportunity to learn from your peers, to open up new creative perspectives, and to strengthen your own voice by joining it with others. Someone recently came up to me at one of these gigs and told me that our sound was greater than the sum of all its parts. Well, one of those parts, that's me. And I think that's pretty cool. Naturally Ignoring me. <laughs> That's because you just said really rude things to him. <laughs> <laughs>